right, what we're doing here is we're going to repair this delaminated sidewall on this motorhome. You can see that water intrusion was up there where the big light was. And th this area in here is now delaminated. To give you an idea how much delamination we've got, this course wall should be flat. As you can see, it's not. We can get this paint stirrer in each end. So we've got a hump there. And over on this side, we have a larger area. And again, the water intrusion came from a light fixture on this side. And it came down under this window and we have a much larger area here. As you can see, we have a larger bubble, if you will. So the way we'll get to this one is we're gonna take the window out here and we'll introduce the material down in there. To do this repair and to get this sidewall to re-adhere, we're gonna use a low viscosity epoxy mix that will run down all the way down to the bottom. It's very thin material and we're going to inject it in through this hole uh, where the light was with this syringe and we'll inject it into there and then we're going to press against it to hold it in place till over probably 24 to 36 hours to let the epoxy set up. Okay. We're going to use, as I said, this uh, syringe and tube to inject the uh, low viscosity epoxy in behind the things. Then we'll take this sheet of plywood and we've got this foam stuff on the side to protect the side of the motorhome. We'll put that against the motorhome and then put these rods between the uh, board and the building to hold pressure on it. You can get these at uh, Harbor Freight. For about $14, they come four feet long. They're made for the back of a pickup truck, but you can cut them off and cut them to the size you need them to fit your building. Okay, now we're going to do the repair. All right, we're injecting the epoxy uh, in behind the raised fiberglass panel that should be laminated to the side. All right, we're gonna put pressure on the. All right, can you hold the board for me? I get this in. We're gonna put pressure on it. It cures. 